Hey there, my name is Jennifer Terry. I make Philippine travel updates. This is a reopening update. So we heard the big news last November 20 on reopening, right? Like we, and this is something different. You know, this is not a study or an, uh, a discussion. The IATF confirmed that they approved it. The Secretary of the Department of Tourism is very proud to announce that the Philippines will reopen soon. But again, it's not a reopening to the whole world. According to the announcement of the Secretary of the Department of Tourism, Tourism, the Philippines will soon reopen to fully vaccinated tourists from green countries. And you already know, if you've been following travel updates in the Philippines, that this precious green list country consists of, well, country, some of countries that we have never even heard of. More than 10 of them are in Africa. Um, there's only a few countries, few major countries, I'd say, like Japan. Uh, Japan is a green country, Taiwan, Hong Kong, United Arab Emirates, Saudi Arabia, Kuwait, Indonesia, India, Pakistan. Yeah, but if you're asking, you know, you already know US, Canada, Australia, New Zealand, majority of European, European countries are not on the Philippines green list countries. Meaning, with that reopening that will be happening soon, um, tourists from China or Japan, uh, from UAE will be among the first to enter the Philippines. Jennifer, when is that reopening? There is no announced date yet, okay? But rest assured, this is already approved. It came from the mouth of the IATF spokesperson that they approved it. And, uh, you know, the Department of Tourism is very happy to announce it officially. So there is, yeah, do not hesitate, do not doubt. Yes, the Philippines will reopen soon. But to select travelers, to selected countries. Right now, they're still finalizing the travel guidelines. As you know, it takes a little bit of time. But the IATF spokesperson already said that they will soon announce immediately as soon as the guidelines are finalized. So that's the initial plan. I'm sure, I'm sure the Department of Tourism, you know, pushed for, to reopen to the whole world. But as always, um, we have the IATF experts to please. They, are, they have the final say. And this is what they agreed upon. So it's still, you know, it's still progress. We're still better off than last year or than uh, three months ago when reopening was never even talked about. This is a move forward. This is progress. This is improvement. Do not lose hope. If you're from a yellow country, there's two options for you. You go to a green country, stay there for 14 days, then enter the Philippines. Jennifer, that's expensive. That is time consuming. I know, right? And it is also risky because you don't know whether that green country will stay on the green list. When you travel, they could be removed for we don't know but that's the another option okay it's risky it's expensive it's time consuming another option wait till your yellow country will be included on green list or wait till the plan for yellow countries will be implemented so what is the plan on yellow countries the deal the department of tourism is working with a small technical working group on its travel proposed vaccinated travel lanes or bubbles program to allow entry of vaccinated tourists from yellow list countries under the certain restrictions and strict conditions so it's very clear hint here fully vaccinated tourists fully vaccinated tourists so the philippines is only considering allowing fully vaccinated tourists so there's a hint there um travel bubble so vaccinated travel lanes sound exactly like what singapore has which of which the department of tourism shared before in an interview that we posted here on youtube that um, they want to follow other countries in having travel bubbles so what is this travel exa travel bubble ex exactly mean in which two countries agree or a few countries agree that so you will accept our tourists and we will accept your tourists like an exchange gift um 
But if you think about it, like I know your country, guys, North America, do not even have quarantine protocols for travelers from Philippines. And if you are a Filipino tourist with a valid visa, they will accept you in, in the US, in Canada, in Aus and even in Australia, if you have a valid visa in a travel exemption, you can enter. So other countries are not making it difficult for Filipino tourists to enter. So how about we give the same privilege to tourists here? I think, you know, these vaccinated bubbles will take time. It will take time. You know, Thailand, they didn't have bubbles. They just made their own list of countries whom they will accept. And that was it. We should do the same thing. If we want to attract tourists to our country, let's not make it complicated. And another update is that since we will be um, welcoming foreign tourists soon, but foreign green countries, there is also talks about increasing the travel cap. If you don't know, um, flight to the Philippines is expensive because we have a limited arrival capacity. So this is being pushed uh, to increase the arrival cap so more, fe more people can enter the Philippines. And I'll answer some questions from you guys from the last video. From Baron, do we still require visa before traveling or has it gone back to what it was before? I like that. Has it gone back to what it was before? We don't know yet. There is no announcement yet from the IATF about the travel guidelines. So let's just wait for the guidelines, yeah? So we don't have any info. Hopefully that it will just go back to what it was before. Next is from Jason. Or am I wrong? Tourists are allowed to come now from Yellow? No, not yet, Jason. Philippines is still closed as of the Philippines is still closed as of now. We're still waiting from the final guidelines from the IATF. Okay? Let's wait for it. As soon as I find out, guys, you already know less than an hour from the announcement. I will let you know. We are steps ahead. Next is from Lee Rose. I always check your channel. Thank you, Lee. Thank you so much. My fiance is from the US. Can he travel to a green country and stay there for 14 days and fly here as a tourist by then? It wasn't really elaborated on the new IATF member. New IATF US resolution earlier because there is still there is still no final guidelines on the reopening of foreign tourists. We're still waiting on that. But if the current protocols for green lanes will be followed for foreign tourists, yes, one can do that because it's not about the nationality. It's not about your citizenship. It's not about that. Green lanes is about your travel history. So whether you are an American, a New Zealander, a Canadian who has stayed for 14 days in a green country, then you can avail green lanes. That, is, that has been the protocol. Okay, so let's just wait for the final guidelines. Do not buy your tickets. You know, you can make your plans in your head, but please do not buy tickets or, you know, big, make big decisions that involves money and other people and your time because we have to wait first for the announcement, the final travel guidelines from the IATF. Okay, next question is from Glory Case. Tanong ko lang po, I have a question, foreign tourists from yellow list, can they enter with a negative test result and I'm quarantined for 3 to 5 days? Not yet, not yet, no, no, hindi pa po, they still cannot enter as of now. Rosanna, Jennifer, what about US foreign tourists? Now US is under yellow list, so we have to wait for the... Um, their decisions on yellow list countries. For now, the reopening will first start with green countries and we are waiting for the final guidelines and the implementation date. There's a chance, there will be a chance for you to enter. Unlike right now, like there's absolutely nada unless you're married to a Filipina. But soon there will be options. So that is what we're looking forward to. I'll see you with more info on reopening. Uh, please uh, like this video and share it to anyone who wants to travel soon to give them the realistic update. I'll see you in another update. Stay safe and God bless. Bye.